Hi, my name is Dave Sumero, and today I'm going to give a project update for Genomagic. Genomagic is a bioinformatics tool for genome assembly projects. Due to an increase in genomic data, due to low costs for DNA sequencing, various genome assemblers have been developed. And because of that, genome assembly projects require scientists to run various genome assemblers in order to figure out the best particular assembly for their particular organism. Running these various assemblers is challenging because it requires for the user to know various parameters for each assembler and their various nuances in execution. Therefore, an app is required which runs all these various assemblers and reports on the comparative statistics of all these assemblers in order for the scientists to figure out the best assembly for their project. The goals for this project at this hackathon were to create this application uh, which for biologists runs various assembly softwares on their genomic data. Also another goal for this project was to create a visualization which shows the comparative statistics for all these assemblers in order to figure out the performance of various assemblers and identifying the best assembly. Prior to doing the assembly, another goal for this project is also to do a post-assembly annotation given the best assembly. However, not all of these goals were met during this hackathon. So what we were able to get through, that a simple application was created, um, which given the raw data and various assemblers, it performs the assemblies. Another thing that we were able to achieve is a well-structured project architecture, whereby the modular development um, is simpler. Therefore, later down the road, when more features are supposed to be added, it is programmatically easier to do so. One of the other things that we made sure was all the third-party applications such as the assemblers and uh, various quality control softwares that were required were outsourced using Docker containers. Therefore, running a different program is just a matter of swapping the Docker containers and the associative commands. In the future, we plan to do end-to-end -end testing for the project on some example data. We were not able to get through this during the hackathon, unfortunately. Another goal for this project is to also create a visualization for comparative statistics reporting. We would also in the future like to finish up on the quality control functionalities for the raw data before assembly. And lastly, we would like to implement the code for doing maker annotations on the post-assembly data. Thank you very much for watching. I'd be remiss if I didn't mention Flavi Vedan, who's also a developer in this project. Without his help, this project would not have been possible. Have a great day.